Hey, what's up people? Martin Unix here. And uh, welcome again to another educative tutorial. It's another beginner's tutorial actually, guys. And uh, today I'm going to show you how to do space bands. And those space bands, guys, will be comprising of a four-strand round braid. So, and uh, just to create facial impression, guys, I'm going to do a touch of color so that you can clearly see how our strand is coming out welcome guys so guys we are not going to do all the strands we are just going to do some sections and uh, to be precise just at the either at the center or at the end remember this is temporary color guys and we are doing application on temporary dreadlocks all right guys as you can see now we are through with the color uh, we are through with the coloring part now i'm going to take you through the four strand round braid i'm going to take you through step by step or not to do to do that and uh, thereafter we are going to do a locked up burn that is uh, we shall have two space bands welcome guys and this is the way to go about it now remember guys that uh, the size of the strands matters if my strands could have been thinner than this I could have used two strands instead of one but since uh, as you can remember I've just told you that uh, these are artificial locks and uh, the, the texture is wanting and the strands are a little bit larger so I'm going to use single strands. So uh, this way to go about it. There are two colored sections and two uncolored sections. All right, guys, remember this is the right side and this is the left side. Now we are going to kick off with the left side. Pick a strand. Let it pass under two strands. That is it has gone under the the second left strand then it has come in between the far left the far right strand and the second right strand then let it pass over the second right strand back to where it was now after coming to this hand it will be at the second position you see guys pick a strand from the right side repeat the same let it pass under these two middle strands that is it will pass under the second right strand then it will come in between the far left strand and the second left strand and it will come back to be the second strand on this particular position that way it passes in between there back to where it was pick this strand let it pass under these two sections that is the second left uh, strand and it will also pass under the second right strand that way guys the strand will come in between the second right strand and the far hand right strand it will come in between here that way and it will go back to second position on the left side and the sequence continues. You pick this strand, let it pass under two. Let it come the second here. Pick this strand from far left. Let it pass under two. Let it come second to this position. That way, guys, you see? That way. After reaching the current part, guys, you'll see how the difference is coming out. This, this guy is now what we call the four strand round braid. 
and this is how you stitch together the, the strands to come up with the round braid. You see? That way. That way, guys. Now, since guys, now we have reached the part where the current part is, I think uh, you'll be able to see clearly what I'm doing. You pick this strand from the left side, let it pass under the two sections, that is the second uh, right strand and the second left strand, coming in between these two current sections going back to be the second strand in at the left side pick the colored part let it pass like that underneath let it go back to the right side being the second strand at the right side pick the far end strand from the left side let it pass under these two colored strands going back to be the second strand at the left side pick the left the right strand the far hand right strand let it pass under these two uncolored strands let it go back to be the second strand at the right side that way guys now you come up with the four strand round braid I've been so elaborative just for the sake of our beginners so that you can catch up guys. Remember to subscribe to my channel if you are new here. So after reaching the hand guys, now I'm going to secure the tip that way. I'm going to secure the hand. Now see how my four strand round braid looks like. You can have a look on the, the black part, how it's coming out, and the gallant part. Let's do another section just for the sake of our beginners. Remember guys, just for the sake of our slow learners, we are going to repeat uh, on what I've just done. We have these two sections which are colored on the right side and we have these two sections which are not colored on the left side. So to come up with the, the four strand uh, round braid, you pick this strand here, guys you see, we are going to start with the right side this time round. Let it pass under two strands, that is it will go under the second strand from the right side and it will come under the second strand from the left side thereby coming in between the two strands that is the far strand at the left side and the second strand at the left side going back to be the second strand at the right side through action guys I know you can catch up and get to know what I'm doing that way like that that way that's how you do the round braid guys the first one round braid
number guys it's just it's all about creativity and giving out many ways you know to to mold stones into meaningful uh, styles styles which look pleasing that way guys remember guys i shall show you thereafter on how to do the space buns i want to do uh, i want to lock up the uh, the sections together to come up with the space buns so guys you need to watch this up to the end and remember to subscribe to my channel if you are new here See how our four strand round braid is coming out, guys. So these are my two sections, guys. Let me take you through the the molding process to come up the two space bands quickly. All right, guys. This is how to go about the space bands. I'm gonna mold the sections together to come up with two uh, bands which are resembling each other that way guys i will be picking strands after the other wrapping them around like that the band the bottom that's the first section pick the next strand like that remember not to cause tension guys pick the next strand that way you pick the next strand Remember guys, you pick the strands the way they are, the way they are following each other. Then you pick these strands here. The vinyl section. Remember to subscribe to my channel if you are new here.
remember to subscribe to my channel if you are new here. Alright guys, now we are through. You can have a look on our style has come out. It's a nice style guys that you can uh, flaunt fashions with. As well guys, this is a style that you can use uh, when you're going out for adventure, that is picnics. And it's a nice style guys that can match all informal sectors. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you are learning together. Uh, I hope this tutorial has been helpful both to our beginners as well as being a high opener to our first learners. I promise to bring more tutorials as time goes by. So I would request you guys to like my work, comment, share to your friends and stay locked for more tutorials to come.